Welcome to my tutorial and today I'm going to be teaching you how to get a shadow in Adobe Photoshop and it's really easy so it's not going to be perfect like things that I don't want to like we can I could take the time but I just want to teach it to you quick so you know and then so here we go first thing you want to do is just open up Photoshop of course and once that's open just go to Google and you want to Google search green screen and just go to images and just get the girl on the green screen right here and I'll just save that as lady and just go back to Photoshop and just bring the file in and what you want to do next is go over to the right side and where it says background you see a lock if you double click it twice and click OK it becomes layer zero and now what you want to do is go up to the eraser tool right click and go down to magic eraser tool and just click on the image the green part and boom the green is gone and it's still a little green around her but that's okay because we're not being consistent and not taking enough time to to do the proper method but here we go you now we want to make a new layer so just make a new layer and we want to make the background white so if you just go down here and go to white and go to the bucket the pink bucket click white and just click on it it becomes white and my computer's taking a while so okay and if the white is over your layer if you just click on layer zero and drag it up and just click and hold and just drag it above layer one it comes it becomes on it comes on top of it sorry about that um okay and once that's done you just go to layer zero if you right click blending options um go down to drop shadow it's the first one and as you can see she sort of got like a shadow right there and if you want the shadow it says distance spread and size and if where it says like spread you just go there and you want to spread the shadow like that it spreads but we don't want to spread it and it goes distance what you want to do as you can see right here like if she was standing up on a building you can see the shadow right here it says distance you see the shadow in shadow out shadow in shadow out sort of like a ghost watch and it can basically be a blur like that you see if you go to size it like blurs motion blur something like that like a blur and then size it it's a blur and yeah that's basically how you make a shadow so thanks for watching my tutorial rate comment subscribe do what you do Demarcus191, thanks for watching my